Hello YouTube and welcome to the start of a brand new Let's Play for Civilization 6. I am the game mechanic here with a brand new uh, Canada game. You might be like, why Canada? Uh, and I get that. I understand that on like a visceral level. Why Canada? Uh, but uh, the reason is, it's one, it's been snowy and blizzardy in Denver here, and so playing a Tundra Bay Civ makes a lot of sense. I'm also looking mostly with this game to test out the brand new, well, not super brand new at this point, but the, the new Preserve District. Um, that, that's going to play well with our national parks, which we can get in abundance as Canada. Um, and uh, I, I kind of want to see how powerful this feels, see how good it is to like get one out somewhat early. Uh, etc cetera, etc cetera. i'm also prepping for a tournament uh that's happening in april it'll be on april 10th and 17th so if you aren't doing anything and you want to see me play in a multiplayer tournament stop by twitch.tv slash the game mechanic and come join us live in person on the internet um but so we're not playing with any game modes uh and i am using the better balance start mod as well uh and so you might see some natural wonders and things that might be a little bit unfamiliar uh, but mostly it's going to be somewhat of a vanilla flavored game and um, yeah, we're playing Canada. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. We got a decent start here. Uh, this is this is Pangea. That the tournament will be on continents, uh, but it is an eight-player map. So there are eight people in here, which is gonna put pantheons at risk. Uh, I'm not looking to take Nerf Goddess in this one. I'd prefer Dance of the Aurora, which is, tends to be a popular choice by the AI. So we'll just we'll just kind of have to see uh, see how that works and 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 play it by ear just a wee bit. So I think I like to settle in place here. We have two two tiles. Uh, unlike Russia, we, there's no real incentive for like moving into deep tundra for a start. Uh, we don't have a, we don't have their tile selection, and then we also don't have really a benefit from tundra early on. Uh, just need to uh, just need to get builders and stuff in in order to 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 get some of the the Canadian benefits of making tiles like normal tiles um yeah so let's settle in place we could use this for a temple of artemis doesn't look crazy good i don't see a lot of plantations we don't see a single luxury yet either uh i do want to go for a religion i'm thinking about going i'm thinking about my early tech here and whether or not we should go for animal husbandry so that we can improve the deer and the sheep or if i just should, should just go right for astrology i think i'm i think i'm down with astrology because I, I i mean two tiles here is fine we just won't get an early builder right away TOA is worth it for the housing. Yeah, that, that, there's an argument for that, to be sure. So we have a 2-1 base and 2-2 two, two tiles to work. We'll go ahead and start with a scout. Oh, yeah, I'm also, I also have a floating head because it's St. Patrick's Day and I'm wearing a green shirt, which is why I have a floating head because green's green's nice. Okay. little swath of land here do i want to double move or do i want to go find city states i really want to just go find city states but i feel like this double move is decent then i cross the river we probably end up in a similar spot ultimately exceptionally flat we do have a volcano here that maybe can improve some resources but at least one city can go down over here we could think about uh preserving in between them with some national park shenanigans yeah it could be the uh, tundra volcano i doubt it though it's only charming appeal so it's pretty unlikely that uh that that's gonna be a wonder and yeah there's some coast down to our south uh so we'll we'll kind of have to see but we've got we've got uh we can explore east and north still yep just a normal just a normal tundra see we'll see settle the hill here maybe we'll see yeah the two two tile like better workable tiles i'm just sort of pinning the general direction as i go here we're, we're definitely going to spend a lot of time pinning and i will probably leave a lot of that here in the videos um so be prepared for your fast forward button but between between the ice hockey rinks and the preserve district and wanting to get normal districts as well like there's going to be some pretty complex city planning so we'll try to put on a clinic. Got some elephants and we have mercury. Mm -hmm. 
as we thought. Perhaps uh, a <laughs> stupid Mercury tile. It's exactly uh, and uh, whatever. Um, we did find a second continent. The uh, the geothermal fissures can usually be a decent indication of that. Not stoked to have Mercury on our home continent. I don't want a mineable luxury, really. Um, and I don't think I want to take the time to uh, send a scout over here. So I'm just going to grab this first goody hut. It could be the astrology Eureka that would be really beneficial. It could be a scout. It could be a builder. It could be any number of things that would be really, really helpful. Unfortunately, we got the masonry boost, which is far less helpful than we wanted it to be. But there's a city state here, a uh, scientific one. So that'll be decent. Can get us to astrology in a reasonable amount of time, maybe. I think I'm going to go with a second scout to maybe find a natural wonder and or a faith-based city-state to, uh, to to get our pantheon going. One of my major concerns here with, with the early game on Canada, like one one of the many, 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 many nice things about Russia is that you start you generally start with a bunch of faith per turn, uh, and that, that can help secure you with Dance of the Aurora uh, versus this is a game where I would like that, but I really have no way of, of getting it at least early on. So we see more coast over here. So coast down here, coast coast over here, which means maybe I just want to cross the river. We have barbarian a barbarian sighting as well here, so things are going to get a little little bit a uh, little bit risky. Um, this is a very nice city state forest. Gives us great people points for districts, and uh, that was a first meet. So we have an extra science and an envoy there, and they want me to build a holy site, which is something I'm planning to do anyways. So we might be able to suzerain them somewhat reason some somewhat early. Again, no secret societies here. None of the uh, none of the super snowbally uh, things. The mountain on the top right. That is a that is an interesting desert mountain. Yes. All right, I'm glad the land keeps going. We have salt as well as mercury. That's a that's kind of a double, a double yikes. Go work the two two. I may not go right into a settler after that scout. I may need to get a, a unit for these barbs. We're already in a little bit of uh. A little bit of a scary spot. Well, that city will be salty. Mayra! Hi, friend. It's a good day to watch some Civ. Thank you so much for the 45 months. Thank you, founder Mayra. How are you, friend? It's uh, I, I've, I've noticed that you've been playing some Valheim. How, how have you been liking it? I showed, I showed chat my base yesterday. This is better. I like spices. Okay, who dis? Who dis? Yeah, it's like it's seriously such a good game. Such a good game. Um, astrology. Do we want a hard tech astrology? Working as an actual contractor, and it's been nice. That's 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 great news. That's great news. I think I want to try to find this Eureka. I hate not knowing what our pantheon's gonna be. What is this scout doing? I'll go get this as well. And then I'll probably start start to circle back with the warrior. <laughs> what are you talking about? What's wrong with my shirt? You know what your pantheon could be? Oh, yeah? Stone circles? Let's see. That would be... Um, zero faith per turn. Cool. Seems interesting. <laughs> Why are you Magyarországnak királya, ellenségim ostora, az igaz híveknek védelmezője. Üdvözöllek. So do I send him a delegation? So I can get a city up here. And then hopefully We've got more land this way, I guess. All right. Please don't kill me. I'm Canada. It's a bit unfortunate. So what am I doing with this scout now? Having coast here, coast here, and him up here means the second scout is not as good as it could be. 
Um, let's see what this is. Yeah, finding the first barb camp and any huts that might be down here seems interesting. I guess this scout is going to go this way. So if I can get a city here and here, we're actually, gonna, of course, going to expand to the non-tundra first. Um, this it is odd to have this uh, desert mountain here. This is a single desert mountain tile, with no other desert to speak of. Yeah, I think this other one has does have to go down and and just make sure that we're that we're totally. I, I'm pretty sure we're at the bottom of the map. Pretty sure. Pretty sure. All right. So we're pop two. We grow in nine. Uh, and yeah, I'm looking to take care of some barbs. And so perhaps... Uh, I really want to just get a monument or a settler. But I think I need a unit. Hopefully that, that is going to be enough. I don't know, Red Duke. I don't, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what he's talking about. So there's the camp. We found it. And indeed, we have just a, a sliver of land. Just a little sliver of land. <laughs> I just don't know, Red Duke. I'm sorry. I mean, there's a... Yeah, there were some wonders, like, in the preview video. Yeah, there you go. That that That's probably what he's talking about. I don't I don't know what he means by Petra-like, but yeah, I... Okay, so I guess I can see that they're Petra-like. I guess I could see that. Yeah, no no patch notes, yes, but you can go to YouTube and find Frax, Fraxus's Civ channel and, and uh, check out the, the preview. This is not exciting land all of a sudden. Yeah, the warrior's coming back now. Meteor? I could use this unit like real bad style. He's already got a second city here. Ugh, this is going to be a problem. I see you're playing bad Russia. Yeah. I suppose this could have come up. Uh, I, I think I do want to grab this. I think it'll help clear this camp. And then we'll have those units explore the rest of this coast. And I'm just going to start heading this way. So... Oh, he just means a total. I I, th I I read that as like he, we're adding in six new wonders. I'm like, there are only two. He means that there will be six Petra-like wonders in the game. So like Petra, Mausoleum, St. Basil's, uh, the Marsh Wonder, the Rainforest Wonder, Huey is a Petra. <laughs> There's all kinds of Petras. It's, it's like how everything's a, a sandwich, but in Civ, everything's a Petra. There's more land this way. If nobody else is over here, this will be decent. That is best. All right. So we're going to just kind of put in God King and pray that we get the Pantheon we want. I also need discipline. I, with going two scouts, you really do want to run a uh, survey. Uh, but because I, I, I am going to have basically have a slinger try to battle this barbarian... Uh, I think discipline is required for us. I'm just going to move over and grab it. Hey, Zemquin. How you doing? I'll go towards the boosted foreign trade here.
Oh. That's interesting. Sort of. Totally in the snow. Uh, Zowsy, thanks for the follow. Welcome, welcome. River Valley is kind of like a Petra. River Valley is kind of like a Petra. I may have to get a second unit. That We just had a Slinger spawn. I'm about to have a War Chariot, which is a thing. really need to get a city going though i can maybe buy another unit here soon i, I really want to get this this uh settler uh to, to to hopefully settle up here actually or maybe eventually uh thank you so much dirk thank you for the four months welcome on back to the shop it's good to have you here thank you thank you i'll let the scout find this by the way it's already on its way so yeah, I know that War Chariots aren't great against barbs, but there's a Slinger that spawned. And it's just a free unit that I can have. No, come on. Be, 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 be elsewhere. Don't be close. Don't be down here in the tundra. It's my tundra. There are no modes active. Are you serious? Where is he? Oh, he found me here. Okay, so if he's up this way, I'm pretty happy. If I can just kind of expand to the west here, I will be very, very pleased. Hey, Ryu. How are you doing? All right, so there's our free military unit. Ooh, I could maybe... Let's see how this goes. So we're going to try to trick them to continue to chase our slinger while maybe we can clear this with the heavy chariot. Um, this may just shoot us, and that would be kind of bad. And we've got a, something for our warrior to do already, so can't really join that party. I'm going to see if I can find the city to send it a trade route later. Population three. I will probably eventually have to buy this horse tile. So do I want to do it now? This is a yikes. I'm going to try to go through his land. Is a yikes. I'm taking nerf goddess as a pantheon. I'd prefer dance of the aurora. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you kidding me, game? Oh my goodness.
Which China is better in my opinion? I like I like I like I like the original. I feel like we'll get this Eureka. So we can switch off of that for now. Maybe go grab mining. So I can chop woods to place districts, maybe. Mongolia in the game. Try to bait him back. An enormous and lofty column of flame allowed the people in Holt to read as perfectly at night as if it had been day. So that's an interesting one for for Canada. I mean, we do we we can do some s snow shenanigans. Um, can I pronounce that wonder for you? Yeah, that wonder for you. No problem. No problem. See, nailed it. Uh, but yeah, that's already obviously pretty interesting, so. <laughs> Let's see if this works. Yields already getting pretty crazy. Yeah, we could build preserves around it. I don't like all the salt and mercury, but what do you do? Sometimes Freddy's just there. <laughs> nice cookie. You gonna come hit me? Get jabated. All right, settler in two turns. I'm gonna go ahead and buy a warrior. I've got barbs coming from there, uh, and I, I I'm going to need to probably escort this settler. Why did the discovery not trigger the astrology, Eureka? It did, it did. And we'll finish that real quick, actually. All right, don't erupt on me. Yeah, playing Canada. Mostly wanting to check out preserves. Um, so we'll, we're, we're going to need some serious city planning at some point, but it's too early for that now. I was going to say, I assume we get hit there. I am actually looking for a religion in this game. It's a really bad attack, but it, it, it it's somewhat beneficial, and it just got us a, a level up, so I, I think actually um, it, it's fine there. This is a bit more problematic. I'd really like to settle this and block him from, from settling us further here. Um... I'd also like to settle up here for the same reasoning. And then it looks like we're going to be able to hopefully knock on all the wood, expand all the way over to this, eventually settle the wonder. I have no my body. Tis a flesh wound. Tis a flesh wound. <laughs> I have become Casper, terror of nights and streamer of ages. <laughs> Let's go ahead and uh, engage this. Miss the archer, Eureka. Yeah, that's a fair point. We did indeed, but I think I think there will be other opportunities for it. I don't believe it. Didn't even hit. Man, barb barb logic is 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 gotten interesting. <laughs> Thanks, Atlas. Uh, I think I like charge here. Let's take charge. 
Dr. Gonzo, thank you so much for the 32 months. Welcome back with that Prime. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. I appreciate that a lot. Thank you, thank you. One pass up the opportunity to add to a growing list. 925 immortal quotes of, of dumb stuff that I've said. Um, okay, so this is where it's tricky. I guess I could skip the holy site for now in hopes that we, we do get Dance of the Aurora because it's going to change our positioning quite a bit. So I think I go for a monument. Is he either a monument or builder here? Dorks! Just got back from vacation in Florida. It's cold here, and now we're playing Canada. Indeed. Welcome back, Dorks. Thank you so much for the Just two months. Just got back from vacation in Florida. It's cold here, and now you are playing as Canada. Burr. Burr, indeed. Burr, indeed. Thank you very much. Thank you for the repeat prime. Yeah, I'm thinking about the. I'm thinking about the builder. It might be better to get that before before the monument. I can see it. Saltis, thank you for the 30 months. Welcome back with that prime. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Want a holy side help get a pantheon faster? So we're 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 currently slated to get our pantheon in 14 turns, and it takes eight turns to build the holy site. So once we're done with that, it will have plus three. And so you're shaving off a turn, maybe, by building it. And we might be able to put it down here if we get the Pantheon we want. And I can save, I can I can either, I can like National Park this. It like gives us better options, I think, if we wait on the holy site. But yes, it, it will give us some faith gem, but I don't think it saves, shaves off a meaningful amount of turns. Do I just take this settler and settle over here? Xantium, where are your cities? That's a first meet, so his cities are not over here. Don't say any green. Yes, you do. Don't you shave off five turns? Okay, so so we're, we're at one faith per turn. Uh, in eight turns, we'll be at 19. The following, the following turn... We shave off four turns. We do actually shave off four turns. But it commits us to it, right? Uh, yeah, I really want to know that I'm Aurora first before I before I before I plan it. I mean, this is a fine this is fine, and it does get better with Aurora. Like it turns into a plus six holy site. Last time we're gonna see them as a city state? Yeah, that's true. Lisbon will be, will be, be become capital. So where would this city go? I really need to forward settle up though. So give me the vision. Lisbon's your home? Cool. That'd be cool. Fez is not a first meet. Trigger the Eureka for wheel. And we will do that. Uh, Cause we've got a copper here and we've got a builder on the way. So we get some science out of that. Do Tundra Mountains give plus two with Dance of the Aurora? No. Unfortunately, they do not. Their Tundra Trials, they should. Yeah, I mean, I kind of think they should too, but it is what it is. I have no idea, Humlocks. Uh, do, do I think Frax is going to bring a whole new uh, DLC package? No, I can't. I, I have zero inside info. I have no idea. Um, no idea. I, I hope so. I think that would be cool. But there's also a lot in this game already, right? So. Nice, Noble. Welcome in. Welcome in uh, from, from Civ Fanatics. You know, that's. I. I <laughs> 
for for as much as I'm like obs like I've been streaming Civ Six for four years, and yet I don't. Why am I not like on the Civ Fanatics forums? I I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I just get enough of it <laughs> in my day to day. But welcome in. Thanks. Thanks for being here, and uh, appreciate it. You'd rather them announce Civ Seven? I mean, that you're gonna have to wait on. I don't think that's coming anytime soon. Great bath, turn 28 here. We've got chariot archers. This is a bit of a pickle here. With all of these barbs. What do we do? How do we manage this? Hey, Ice Cold. How you doing? Becoming overwhelming with content content. I, I, I do think that is a bit of you know, that is something you wanna you wanna manage. Um I mean I, I, I will I wouldn't say no to more content, don't get me wrong, but like you, you, you do need to walk the line between like Civ already being a complex game and um like overwhelming people. I think Civ seven will improve on the district model, I'll bet you anything. I, I, I would imagine if I were to project a lesson onto what they've learned from Civ Six, and and I, I this is just me speculating, is that they learned that districts are really cool and a fun mechanic because it, it makes like building cities fun, but also that people enjoy tile yields, right? Hence hence the uh, disaster modes and 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 those types of things. So I would imagine that whatever Civ Seven looks like, it will improve upon these mechanics uh, and not not just you know, run away from them or whatever. I don't know. Who knows? Wild speculation. Let's do it. Now what do we do? Pottery? I can't really... Like, I can't really go anywhere with this stinking settler. That, that I mean, I could go over this way, but I'd prefer to go north. I mean, if this is here, he's not settling it either. So there is that. But, like, this is the settler I have, right? I think, I think we move like this. All right, what do we get here? A uh, relic? No, a builder. Well, good thing I'm building one. Not actually a good thing. I don't have that many tiles to improve here. We can do it. I'll still take it. It's a nice find. Do I switch away from the builder we have now? Finish it at some point. Like, I can improve this, this, and then maybe buy this tile as well. Sid six improvements to make pizza as a luxury resource. David Bowie is a great musician. <laughs> I like it. I like it. I like it. Yeah, I'm with you. There's uh, Zarkon. That sounds about right. I, th I think I can finish that later now. Stonehenge, 29. Trying to get the level on this. A little bit more. Daniel Craig is a unique barb unit. <laughs> this
Is it next month already, Atlas? Holy cow. Humankind right around the corner. Proposed, proposed to make Carl a unique barbarian unit? Yeah, Carl Barian. Carl Barian's a, it's a crowd pleaser. All right. No, nothing switching here. This we're on our way for. And now we're going to get some culture, finally. All right. So now we have a decent tile here. And we'll want to improve the sheep as well, or the copper, or this. You're not at all done with Civ Six, yeah? I, 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 just, I echo that sentiment. I think. I'm gonna, br I'm gonna bring this warrior to help escort this settler. I think. Taking a CK three break. People keep telling me to get into that. Gonna come back and do a deity marathon? I like that. Seems pretty good. All right, so there we get our archery boost. And we can start thinking about bringing the settler into this general vicinity now. I think if, uh, because I get, like this is bad for appeal, but it's gonna be good for our science to get this mine. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab that. Okay. He's the one with great bath. I know, all the warmongers. Need nine more era score. Tusa. Did I miss a tribal village with the East Scout? Oh, I did. My bad. Good looking out, chat. Let's go ahead and finish archery as well. I would very much like to heal this scout up. So I will. I don't think I'm going to have the money to buy this horse tile so I can just finish the sheep. Cuz I need I want to upgrade this to an archer. This is spawning. I don't know how to, out of control it is and there are horses around. So having a single archer plus a warrior should should allow me the ability to to kind of do this. Um I think yeah. I think yeah. Hey, uh, Rain, thanks thanks so much. Uh, exclusively watched the VOD, saw you were online, and wanted to say, hey, thanks for the amazing content. Keep up the good work. Hey, thanks for watching. I appreciate that. I, uh, yeah. 
for a while I didn't have like music and stuff because I, I, I valued people watching the uh, the VODs. Uh, and now you just can't have music on Twitch, so. It's a happy, happy coincidence, I guess. Or unhappy if you liked music on streams. But thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Uh, not not fishing for anything, Rain. But but do do note that all of the 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 um, ads that are on the vods go away if you uh, if you have like a prime a prime sub or anything like that. Again, not fishing for it. Just want to let you know, like when I watch other people's vods, it's it can be a little miserable, <laughs> and uh, not having ads on them is great. Just a just kind of a PSA, really. May the forces of evil. Okay, here and here, here and here, there as well. And yeah, Amy taking care of you, of course, of course. Thank you so much, Amy. I appreciate it. Thank you for the gifted sub. Welcome in, Rain. Welcome, welcome. Or you can get Turbo for the whole site. Oh, that works too. That works too. All right, this is healed enough. We're still looking for era score, so I don't want to skimp on the scouting. Thank you very much, Amy. All right, so pottery then? Or do I need to do I need to look at teching something a little further out? Wow, people on holy sites already, huh? 5? Who's got 5? Mongolia already had no. They don't have a prophet. They have great bath. Ooh, bully. So where should this city go? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I, I and again I wasn't I wasn't fishing for that I I am just grateful for for you stopping in and saying hi but uh, yeah our our wonderful community taking good care of you I think I actually settle here it's it's fairly safe it it keeps us on the lower side of the river we're we're close to this for districting there are some okay tiles it's not amazing tile wise but this is a lake. If I move all the way up here, we leave kind of a weird gap. I think I think this is fine. It's not a particularly exciting one. I hope this is a, a decent tile. Otherwise, it's fairly low on tile quality, but high on on like overall position. I guess. Do we want to get over to the spices somehow? And this is where it's going to get a little bit complex as far as planning cities and stuff like that. Because we're going to have to think about both national parks and preserves and our hockey rinks. I guess these northern cities don't really get hockey rinks. Um, we'll have to use our tundra ones. Uh, hi, new to the game. Welcome in, uh, God Kyle. How many production makes it a good city, a.k.a. why, why, are not, why do they pick the recommendation spots? I wouldn't pay I wouldn't follow the recommendation spots too closely. Um, if you start with two two tiles, two food, two production, that's pretty good. Um, and then overall, like your your improvements, like mines and and, and lumber mills I and stuff, would be good. And now I'm there scared. are a lot of reasons to settle a city. In fact, one of the things we're talking about in this exact moment, ideally, your first couple expands either have really good district potential or really good initial tile quality. Um, in this case, I'm giving up some initial tile quality. For, uh, for for basically gobbling up this this space so that the AI doesn't settle like forward settle all of our land, um, and then hopefully we can settle all this land later. So there are a lot of different factors that you're going to consider, especially early on when settling cities, uh, and then and then some somewhere around like you know when you're getting your eighth and tenth city, like it doesn't matter as much, but um, yeah. So there, there, it's kind of a complex answer, um, but uh, hopefully that helps a little bit. Zhao, thank you so much for the twenty three months. Welcome back into the shop.
That is so weird. So desert mountain, desert mountain, flat desert. I wish pyramids were... were, were I, I could try for pyramids. Nothing is not complex in this game. Love it. Yeah, it's, it's a fantastic game, especially if you like sinking your teeth into uh, stuff like that. I am, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm still going to be in the multiplayer tournament. This is just a standard, standard, uh, standard size map and uh, standard speed here today. We'll do more uh, online speed prep later on. All right, so we want to double back with this scout and grab the um, goody hut. Hopefully we get there before anybody else still. Um, and, and I'm still not, I don't know, do we settle in play, or do I just settle across the river? You know what, maybe settling across the river is fine. Like, we eat the, um... Well, is it? What's the view without, this is the, this is the settler view. This is four, number four. Uh, and this is the loyalty. That's loyalty pressure. In place, get an aqueduct industrial zone. And that's not what I'm looking to do. Go east, settle the desert. I don't want. I, I, if I, if anything, I would settle here and put the put the put the campus here. Right. This is a plus four campus tile or a pyramid tile spot. This could also be a plus three campus, which I'd be fine giving up on the extra science if I can get pyramids. There's a really good uh, holy site maybe over here. I think I think we're gonna settle here, and uh, maybe try to grab masonry. I think it's too late already for pyramids, but we could give it a go. Especially with eight sieves in the game. We'll see. So yeah, we'll settle here. Not as safe as this settle. Uh, but I think I think good enough. I'm a little shocked at how many goody huts have been available to us. Right, what tiles do we want to be working? This one and this one. That makes sense. That makes sense. We can grab that as well. Are we going to put a campus where the sheep is eventually? It's possible. City states cannot get goody huts, no. Only other sieves. Irrigation boost is particularly unexciting. Man. Spear, they just can't resist. They just can't resist those. Uh... <laughs> oh, man. Perfect. Governor title. That's uh normally like that's a that's really good already, uh, but even better in our game because we don't have things like secret societies on. So uh, uh, being able to grab a governor here seems pretty good to me. Um, we need four more era score for this golden age. We're not settling a new continent, although we still can. I'm thinking about Amani. Thinking about Amani. If you wanted to do a cute play, you would you could settle the geothermal fissure here. But I, I don't think that's worth it. Yeah, I mean Amani probably secures the Golden Age, although notable that Hattusa and Fez are both sort of spoken for. But we have one here and we have Lisbon. Lisbon could be a pretty good one to send out. plan for getting culture i don't have one yet <laughs> t 
TBD. That's my plan. Pingala could be how we get our culture, frankly. Which is usually the best choice, I think. I do want to start thinking about preserves. You know, if we get a, if we get a quality holy site and that, then we don't really need a money. Although, note that if by not going a money here, we're probably never going to get the error score for suzerain the, uh, suzerain these. So I think we actually can take Pingala here. <laughs> Good to see you, Sir Devilish. How you doing? Yeah, daylight savings time is just so dumb at this point. But I am earlier as a result. End of the era is going to trigger very, very soon. And by soon, I mean literally now. Four turns. Our Pantheon's going to give us era score as well. <laughs> okay. Catholics with choral music and initiation rites. That's kind of crazy. You're 12 and you love this game, uh, but you can only win settler difficulty. Do I have tips for you? Yes, expand early and often. Get those settlers going right away. Uh, as soon as you can, um, on a normal speed, which is 500 turns, I like to have about eight to 12 cities around turn 100. So if you practice that and you practice just getting those cities down, you're gonna have a much, much better time in the game. There's some error score as well. Yeah, I think we're going to be fine on error score. All right, and we are long on this video. So with the introduction of Egypt and just three era score away from our golden age, uh, we will go ahead and put a cut in the video here. Still looking to expand and, and kind of protect some of this uh, tundra-y land that we can kind of fall back into eventually. Um, so thank you so much for watching. If you've been watching over on the YouTubes, I do appreciate it. And we'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to stop by twitch.tv slash the game mechanic and come say hello in person on the internet. Don't forget tournament, April 10th and 17th, 2021. See you there.